What are you making, Kes? Well, I'm making like an apple, something because we're both doing a theme of apple, cooking apple because we picked them up at school. Yeah. And then a tree? we're trying to embed new trees that we have to cook. So like here I've made an apple delicious. tofu. Apple tofu, that looks delicious. And Let's what are you doing in here? Is this a salad? Yeah, this is a salad, but oh, with wow, bits of yeah. apple in it. That's fantastic. And Daniela, what are you making? I'm making a kind of, it looks very messy at the moment, but... It's delicious. But what I'm doing, I'm doing apple in it. And we're going to be having this for dinner. And I like your knife. Is that your knife? Yeah, it's a dinner knife. So this knife. effectively is Stone Age cooking? Well, yeah, effectively. We've gone for a little Stone Age type. It's great. It's fresh. Everything's fresh. So everything's been put in by electricity. And it's fertilised by Elsa. Now, Elsa's what we're the going fertilize. to do, we're doing, I'm doing the nest, little nest inside it. Yeah. And I'm putting the apple nest inside it. So, and I'm going to bake it in the sun. So I'm going to bake it in the sun. See, it's no technology, you know, it's just, it's just fresh. It's going to be a nice apple nesty thing. It looks a little bit messy, but I'm going to make it look nice. Because it's all been mushed out of the apple. I've used the whole apple. And it's brilliant, you know. All of this brown mush from it, yeah, because it just doesn't taste nice. So just throw that all out. It was just to not waste the apple. And the good thing about doing it outside, if you throw it, it grows again. So, so it's all natural, all re yeah. replenishes. Re now she says sometimes only with the apple nest you take the brown stuff. But with what I'm doing, you keep the brown stuff in because it keeps the flavour of the apple. And you're using your rock knife as well. Yeah. That's wonderful work. So we'll come back to you later when it's all done. Well, Daddy, there seems to be something round. What is it? This, darling, is an old record player. When I was a little boy, we used to play with it. And let me show you how it works. Well, first of all, you've wound it up like this. Then you put the needle on the record like that. Nice, nice and safe. You let it go. Oh, we've not wound it up enough. <laughs> Wind it up a bit more until the spring's tighter. Set the thing going. Let's make sure it's level. That'll help. Nope, got to wind it up more. There we go. Here we go. Has anybody here seen Kelly? Hey, K E double L Y. Has anybody here seen Kelly? Kelly, pretty can. If I had it on my own, on my own, has anybody here seen Kelly? Hey, Kelly from the other man. What was the move on? Go in. That's it. The removal van is now going with the last of the stuff from Lily Rose. Lily Rose Cottage now is empty. Shall we take a look? Thank you, David. Right, I'm just having a quick look around there, Sean. Hi, Sean. <laughs> this is the end of my film. Just showing that, that empty house for our film on moving out of Lily Rose Cottage. This will be made into a big film next year, John. This is my video recording of the of what it looks like now. It's empty. Oh, yeah, man. Anything to say to camera? You're a great guy. <laughs> You're a great guy. <laughs> Wonderful guy. Smash it. All of you. <laughs> All three of you. There's Sandy. Hi, Sandy. <laughs> is that not? 
Mark, no, no. It's, I'll show Mark though. Show Say Mark. hi, Mark. Hi, Mark. <laughs> yeah. Jackson. Look what Sandy's doing. <laughs> Mark. <laughs> and there's the lounge. There's young David. He's coming in. This is to show my mum when she's in. What's happened? Your car's annoying. All oh, right, okay. I'll move it. Huh? Oh, sorry. Yeah. No, we won't. Oh, I see. You just get you escaping. Back into You've the done house. a good job. Let's see if we'll have a look upstairs now and see what's going on. I'm going up. I thought you were testing it. See, it's too sore. Look upstairs. Oh, yeah. John will have those. No, he's gone to put some stuff in chairs in the car. Okay, so now it's the hall. That is Sean's room. Sean's life. That's it. Well, not her life. She's got um Sorry Sandra, I'm just doing a quick um a little video. I'm, I'm, I'm tiptoeing. There's our room when we were kids. So, there's the mirror where young Guy Cooper used to stand and go, Ooh, Guy. That's where I used to sleep when I was a kid. Had a few nightmares there. Dave was over there. And here's the, the shrine to Mark's children, which is now empty. The shrine is now empty. And that's what it looks like. I can't believe that this house has been emptied. Unbelievable. I'm going to show you what this belief looks like. That's what, I, that's what, I'm, that's what I'm talking about. Disbelief. Yeah. Empty. Finally empty. Yeah. Bathroom. Never been cleaner, ever. It's never been cleaner in here. Cleanest it's ever been. Unbelievable. Sandy, yeah. the cleanest it's ever been in this house. <laughs> never been this clean, ever. That's what it used. That's what it was like before. And Sandy's just been round with a brush. Look at it. You get your dinner off that floor now. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah. It's clean as well. We did it. Can't believe it's empty. Can't believe it. All right. Does that have to be empty? Yeah, of course it does. Let's see. I've got a little box. We need a box. Um, John, there's a load of bulbs here. Yeah. Okay. Are you really looking to take some notes? I'll take them. I'll find some in the box. Oh. Look at that. Look at the workmanship. Look at the workmanship down there. You don't see workmanship like that anymore. Look at that wall. Who said that we got yeah, damp problems see, that here? No, but that was leaking. Oh, I see. That's why. Look at that. Well, the unit is from. What were you to see? Oh. I wish. Uh, it was. I did, the, the washers had gone. They were leaking. Right. So, yeah. Look, it was leaking through there. Right. right. Time for tea. Well, <clears throat> this is it. This is where it all started. This is the room that me and Dave used to sleep in when we were kids. And uh, you can see, I whacked my head on the doorway for the last time, just as I was leaving. There you go. We have moved everything out and we are now leaving this place for the last time. It's a farewell to Lily Rose Cottage, to all the memories, to Lil, to Mark and me and Dave growing up, Sean, the dogs. Goodbye and the, the next chapter begins.
pan close up. Let's go and finish with a lovely zoom in on the tree. Fade. Yeah, we used to sledge down.